yes yes massive improved back once again with another video and today during all the seasonal flu going about well not seasonal flu but it's going about now and all these coronavirus and this and that i'm just going to share with you what i've been taking to keep myself strong and to fight off any kind of flu symptoms that are coming my way me and the missus we've been drinking this uh concoction and alongside that taking a whirl of supplements every single day uh, the supplements i'll do in another video but just for now i'm going to show you a simple remedy that you can use that is definitely a winner with all flu symptoms obviously you can't treat a viral infection like coronavirus i'm not making no claims here but i do know any kind of congestion you're going to get from any kind of flu-like symptoms this is going to definitely help you and right now there's no medicine towards this thing so this is all i've got and i'm sharing it with you so first thing you need is turmeric powder now you get this from any kind of shop that sells this kind of spicy stuff this is quite cheap couple of quid in the shop no problem there uh, you can get some honey doesn't have to be this honey honey is for, good for, for soothing the throat and uh, it's also very sweet you know it makes the concoction taste a little bit better also it has antioxidants this is a serving for two people and it's one clove of garlic for each person which i peel and i get it down to uh just you know take off with the outer skin also one lemon and lemon is good for a whirl of stuff too um also cayenne pepper i've got my little lemon squeezer so first of all i'm going to show you what i do i've got a little cup to put all this in to get the lemon chop him in half the lemon's chopping off like that then i'll get the lemon essentially and squeeze that in my little lemon squeezer pick this up from amazon put a link in the description let's give that a good squeeze so that's that i've got my lemon juice sorted now pop that there okay next i'm going to show you what to do with that garlic now so the garlic i'm literally just gonna give it a little smash like that with my hand and then it just makes it a little bit easier to peel off all of the uh, surplus around it. There we go. Just chop that off there. A little bit of a end on it as well. So I chop that off. And that's going to go in one cup, right? But not whole because you're going to have to eat the garlic. I know it's a bit rough for those of you who are not like hardcore. But in these times here to survive, you know, what I mean, the way I see it, you've got to be hardcore. Put that there. Now I know this is a bit off off topic for my channel, but in the current situation, who knew who knew that you know what I mean we'd all be trying to help each other. All right, so that's that's that out of the way. So I've got that out of the way, nice and tidy. Okay, guys. So next, the key ingredient I forgot to mention is uh, ginger. So you get your ginger, get a little grater. Next, I'm gonna get me garlic, my garlic squeezer. Put my garlic in there and then squish it. You get a bit of juice come out in the cup as well. Literally just the garlic's all nice and squashed, yeah? Because you, when that, that makes it easier to palate, like when it's time to absorb it, you know, when it's time to, to drink it, right? So I'll pop that in there, make that little, little mixture there. Next, I'm gonna get the turmeric powder. Uh, I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of turmeric powder in there, like so. Yeah. And that, obviously I'm gonna, I'm gonna boil the kettle as well. And then I've got my cayenne pepper. Now you don't wanna put too much of this because it's pepper, right? But you just, you just put a little piece like that in there. Little sprinkle, right? And then you get your honey and then you sweeten to taste according to how you like it yeah so your honey goes in there i've got my organic honey here which i've got from 
from Trinidad. I do like this stuff, but you know, you could just use any honey. You don't have to use. There you go. Well, put me honey in there, right? And then boil the kettle. Bring the kettle to boil. Once the kettle's boiled, I pour the water in, stir it, and, let, and then let it sit for 10 minutes, and then drink it. That's it. And lastly, you're gonna put the lemon juice in there that you squeezed earlier. You can put, you can, you can use a whole lemon, but you know, you're gonna put water in there to last it. Okay, kettle's near, near enough boiled. Now I see some people boiling up this in a pot, but you know, I just believe that to me you shouldn't really cook it out because the herbs kind of lose their enzymes or whatever it is. And it's more effective if it's like this. If you want to put a bit of apple cider vinegar in there, like a little little tablespoon, little teaspoon, don't feel no way. But for tonight, this is what I'm sticking to. Oh, my garlic come out there, look. There you go, mix that up. Let that sit now for 10 minutes and you're good to go. There you have it, that's my flu bomb style drink. And I have that whenever I'm feeling sick and trust me, it works. If you're not already subscribed, please like, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel. In my next video, I'm gonna show you all about the herbal supplements that I've mentioned in this video that I'm going to be taking every day through this whole coronavirus period, yeah? To keep me safe hopefully gonna keep me well. These are all researched herbs that help to prevent respiratory tract infections. I'm not gonna say they're gonna work 100% because I haven't been tested for the old coronavirus, but I have had some symptoms, uh, flu-like symptoms recently, and today I feel great. So, guys, big up your chest, speak to you later.